This is Twit. Hi, Leo. Uh, I've been using X marks for quite a few years, and I just got a notification that uh, it's being discontinued the first of May, and I'm looking for something similar to run. So uh, I think they got bought, didn't they? X marks was a bookmark syncing technology. I, I want to say that um, that Firefox bought it, didn't they? Who bought X marks? Uh, LastPass. LastPass did. But I got a notification from LastPass that they're, they're going to kill it. Yeah. So I think one of the reasons uh, is because both uh, all the browsers I know of do this. Uh, the nice thing about XMarks, it was cross-browser. You know, you could have XMarks installed on Firefox and Chrome, and they would have all the same bookmarks. So it was a really nice feature. But, yeah, that's what I have. Yeah. So, and uh, you, know, you know, it's funny because, I, yeah, I bought XMarks back, back in the day. I used it, and I really loved it. And I've just gotten kind of used to the idea that, well, when I use Chrome, Chrome's own built-in bookmark syncing will work. And, you know, when I installed Safari or Edge or Opera, or Internet Explorer, or any of the alternate browsers, in most cases, they'll say, oh, you want me to pick up your Chrome bookmarks, and I just do with that, even though, and then they sync, even though they get out of sync, right? Because as you add bookmarks to Chrome, they don't get added to Firefox. Yeah. It's a separate system. I think this is kind of analogous to the death of, of, of uh, physical media. It's just, this is the problem that we pay uh, as edge cases, we are not the majority. The majority of people, it's just too complicated to run a separate bookmark synchronization program, so they don't. Um, I'm so, kind of disappointed that LastPass isn't keeping X marks around. Did they, did they say when they um, sent you the notice that there's an alternative? No. I have been using for years, uh, uh, you know, well, Delicious was around for a long time. It was a site that would keep track of your bookmarks, and I've been using yeah. the replay. Delicious got bought by Yahoo and also got trashed for a while. And uh, I started using a system called Pinboard, pinboard.in. That's a paid system. I actually like that because I thought, well, this way they're going to stick around, and they have. They make money on it. And uh, they that's an external sync, not as useful. What you could do, this is crazy, crazy talk, but you, but you could roll your own. <laughs> I know, it's crazy talk, isn't it? But uh, the idea of synchronizing a file or a folder isn't so far-fetched. A lot of people do that as part of their backup. You could store your Chrome bookmarks somewhere, or you could store uh, actually a generic set of bookmarks somewhere in HTML. Chrome will read them. Everybody will read HTML bookmark files. That's what Chrome exports to, Firefox exports to. And uh, you could make that your home page. So synchronize, in other words, you see what I'm saying? Synchronize those, yeah. that external file and make that your homepage. That's, let's see if somebody has come up with a solution. One of the things I liked about uh, Pinboard was when Delicious kind of got bad, the community stepped forward. Some guy said, uh, hey, you know what? We need this, so I'm going to make it. But I think that people who keep track of bookmarks the way you do, and I know people like that, that this is like, this is, like one of their most valuable documents is their bookmark file. Like they spent years collecting these, <laughs> right? Yes. Yes. Exactly. It's every. It's all in there. Um, those people are, you know, uh, I think a dwindling number. And I, I see this in technology. We're getting now. Technology is mature enough that I'm seeing this more and more. Like Oppo going out of business, or or Apple deciding, yeah, nobody wants a Mac. We're not gonna. <laughs> we're not gonna update the Mac. There are a lot of people who want these things but not enough so i think you're going to have to figure out a solution of your own i uh, i mean each browser does this individually but you use multiple browsers right i yeah. do on multiple computers yep well chrome and firefox both will sync to multiple computers so you'll have a standard firefox bookmark sync and that'll be the same everywhere and that's what i do with chrome and i just mostly stick with chrome I guess that's about the only choice. But if anybody's listening and has a solution for the demise of Xmark, that Xmark was was a really it's you know it's it's a little this is a little bittersweet. It's kind of like um, kind of like uh, Oppo going away. It's it's uh, it, times there's, times are changing. The times they are changing, and uh, that's just another way it's happening. Kind of, kind of too bad.